not the visuals. Well, welcome back to channel. Welcome back to Five Fast Facts on a Friday, recorded on the day of Christmas Day. I'm recording this on Christmas Day. How mad is that? Uh, it's down for the visual guys. That's so FFF. And this week, spoiler heavy, spoiler alert. Right, I'm going to give you a couple of seconds here because I'm about to drop some big spoilers for Spider-Man No Way Home. If you haven't seen it, you've got five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. I'll give you an extra second. Six. We're doing Aunt May in honour of her recent passing in that horrible, horrible death scene from Spider-Man No Way Home. So I thought I'd honour Aunt May with an FFF. Uh, and in honour of the reason why we're doing an FFF on her, uh, just like in the film, she has actually died in the comics quite a few times before, but she's always come back and whatnot, and stuff's happened and shenanigans at play. Sometimes they even got genetically older actors to take her place. But yeah, this isn't something new for Aunt May. She's died before. Now, this one's a pretty interesting fact. We all know the most iconic, or well, one of the most iconic deaths from the from the pages of Spider-Man throughout the years is probably the Gwen Stacy at the hands of the Green Goblin. Now, originally, that story wasn't supposed to have Gwen in place. It was supposed to be Aunt May. But at the end, the last minute, they switched it um, to Gwen because the writers couldn't, couldn't come around to killing Aunt May, even though that's happened before. But I'm kind of glad they chose Gwen for whatever reason. I feel like it's a bit more impactful. You decide. Uh, in an alternate universe, she has actually had some spider powers of her own. Yes, that's right. She was a spider person on her, of, on her own in her own right in a different alternate universe, but she was called Spider Mom. Here's another one. She's not only had spider powers; uh, she was turned into a hero called Golden Oldie. I know, a very, uh, very well thought out name there. Uh, where she had like cosmic being sort of powers. She was quite badass. And then powers were given to her by none other than Galactus himself. <laughs> and a nice one to round it off just to uh, bring all of your, uh, you know, your dinners back up. But she, uh, she was once walked in on by Peter himself and she was in bed with J. Jonah Jameson. Can imagine the look on Peter's face. And there we go, visuals. That was this Friday's Five Sauce Facts. If you did enjoy it, Booski, what Booski. Uh, hopefully, I think this is the first ever of the year, I think. And uh, hopefully, year's gone off to a cracking start. Like I said, I'm recording this on Christmas Day, right after my dinner, so I still feel so fat and lovely. But visuals, thank you so much for watching. You guys are literally the fucking best. We're always keeping you. And keep on keeping on.